let's start new project. I'm trying to make this again. This was the old version. Yeah, it looks like something when you put it like that. But the wire has been flattened. So it could have been more shapely. This, <laughs> I'm trying to remake this. And um, I still have some yellow fabric left. And um, I think I'll start with the underwear looking front first. Because that one doesn't need structure and then I'll probably decide how I'm gonna do the rest tomorrow. I'm done for tonight. <laughs> it's the front of an... Let's start. I procrastinated. It's afternoon already. So I pulled from the Pinterest board. The first time I tried to make round loops and I connect them together. Now this one is connected all at one point and then it's the same hoop all the way. And then I'll do this and then extend a little bit for the tail. And then that's it. That's my plan. <laughs> I'm wondering if zip ties will work because they're always round and then if I can fix these two points to be constant then no matter how much they bend they will always bounce back that's my that's my thought so let's try Okay, just now they don't work, so I'm um I made it with chains. It's a, a lot smoother the way this thing flips around. It's a lot smoother. So I put rings jump rings on every one of them and then I connect them, them with a jump ring and then I connected it with a chain. The chain gives tension. So this thing bends. Then I can arrange them in the, the thing that I want that one I have to confirm again <laughs> this is so tiny <laughs> it's so tiny um, I, I don't know how do I extend this after this I didn't film this last night but this is um what I've continued to do after that. Mm. It's the shape isn't that elegant because look at that jut out. <laughs> but um it's too small. It is too small, so what am I gonna do with this? Hello Long time no work on this. This was too small, remember? So I got myself boning. So I'm gonna try again. I don't know how it's gonna go. I, I never know how it's gonna go. So let's go. So I measured it against my butt, at least the first loop. And it comes to this, but I'm not sure and I don't dare to cut because this is not much bigger than this. It's just. It's just this much bigger? Is that a lot bigger? I don't know. Okay, let's, let's just... I don't want waist boning. <laughs> let's just do it. It'll it never happen if I don't do this. Let's cut. It's done. Okay, so far, I have transferred the chain from the old one and the waistband from the old one. This was so tedious to do. So I only did four versus six that I did before. But it should be okay. That just means the gap is wider. Yeah, and I'll figure out the gap and then I'll sew the strip across or I should, maybe I should do the extensions, loops first. Maybe I'll do that first. Update is now that I have made a few loops, so the the chain is, as always is what I use to hold them in the oval shape. I don't know if the oval shape makes sense, but the oval shape smooths out better, 
and then this is the last one that doesn't have the oval shape so now it's a perfect circle and then i took this out from the old one and because the, the this is a bit hard to make smaller so i'll just reuse the smaller one since i have it and then the tip uh i went to cut the unused boning to make a tip so here's the tip lol yeah that's um now i have to see if we can attach this together oh my god it's getting somewhere i feel like the gap up here is a bit too much but i can always fold and sew this and hack it up so i'll do that later well this looks decent finally okay i'll continue then i always make it too short but this top part is not bad it is not bad this is the best it has ever been and uh, i'll show you with the with the leaf cape on it's honestly a very nice little butt bump thing but then you can't see the tail from anywhere so it's such a waste so uh, yeah just have to make it longer it's already better than before a lot better than before what i decided to do is to cut it off and i'll remove these supporting chains these were initially placed when i was only sewing the front so that it lifts it up a little bit but after i sewed the back it kind of just got slacked and that means it doesn't have any purpose anymore so i think i'll just add a few more loops instead of spreading the loops i think which will be a lot more effort i would just add two or three more loops depending on how much effort i want to put in this <laughs> yeah yeah that, that's the plan i think the size difference allows for a few more transitions yeah yeah okay got to work okay improved oh man but you can't tell mm, i'll find another mirror okay it's not under the mirror but um see this is where i used to film but it's gone now okay can you see the the thing the armature the next step will be to cover the armature with yellow so when it's bright yellow it will probably be easier to see and it will go with the underwear piece and the front so <laughs> something <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah i'll figure out how to clad the the armature with fabric another day